Members of a community in the Poconos came together today to donate blood. It was all in honor of a firefighter who was injured on the job. Newswatch 16's Amanda Eustace shows us the tribute to him. The inside of the mess hall here at Polk Township Volunteer Fire Company in Kreskyville transformed into a blood donation site. It's all for Kyle Frabel, a former chief and current lieutenant with Kunkeltown Volunteer Fire Company. Well, I heard about Kyle and everything that he's going through, and I thought it was a good opportunity to hopefully make a difference. I don't know Kyle, but I know his family. I used to deliver their mail years ago and stuff, and um, I'm part of a fire company up in Troxville. So. It's a big family, so when somebody needs help, that's what you do. More than 50 people rolled up their sleeves and donated blood for Frable, the Conkletown firefighter who was injured on Christmas Eve while fighting a house fire. Kyle was at a fill site uh, nearby, uh, filling tanker trucks with one of our engines, where one of the uh, hoses got water hammered. It came up, knocked his uh, leg back and um, where he suffered a uh, multiple pelvic fractures. After a few days in the hospital, Frable went to recover at his mom's house. Then on New Year's Day, he went into cardiac arrest. He was brought to LVH Cedarcrest, where he underwent surgery and several transfusions, using up lots of blood. Conkletown Fire Chief Brian Stankovich says that's why the entire month of January, there have been several blood drives in his honor. Community support, as well as other fire company support, has been great. Um, the countless people and other departments and other agencies that have reached out um, sent donations and just offered to help in any way they can. It's been phenomenal. Frable is currently on a ventilator recovering at Good Shepherd Rehab in Allentown. For information on the next blood drive or his GoFundMe, visit WNEP.com. I'm Andy Eustace, Newswatch 16, Monroe County.